A Mercy One in Des Moines has a new safe haven baby box that could save more lives in central Iowa. It's the second baby box in the state and allows parents to surrender their newborn anonymously. Thank you to Mercy One Medical Center for giving families another option to safely surrender their newborns. On Tuesday afternoon, Mercy One leaders unveiled a new safe haven baby box in Des Moines. The boxes allow any parent wanting to surrender their child born in the past 90 days or less to do so safely and anonymously at any time of day. All the parent has to do is open the door and place the baby into the box, which holds a small temperature regulated cradle. There is a minute delay after the baby is surrendered until the system sends a signal to hospital staff that an infant has been placed in the box. But I am very very passionate about giving mothers another option to safely surrender their babies anonymously and lovingly. It's the second box in the state of Iowa as nearly one year ago first responders opened a safe haven baby box in Fort Dodge, but doctors and state officials wanted to install another closer to the metro providing more accessibility to Iowans. Parents are allowed to leave an infant in these boxes because of the Safe Haven Act, which was passed in 2002. Okay. Since then, 71 infants have been surrendered and placed into the state of Iowa's custody. This box offers no shame, no blame, and no names. Thank you all for coming today. And now with Mercy One Safe Haven box, this marks 270 now in the entire country. Reporting from Des Moines, Connor O'Neill, Local 5 News. According to the Safe Haven Baby Box Organization, 50 babies have been safely surrendered nationwide via a baby box since 2017.